I'm going to go. I need to go do something. Keep right. going. Alright. And laundry. <laughs> Okay, that works. Oops, oops! Oh, dang it. Stop getting stuck on things, jeez. Oh, oh. I don't think we necessarily even need to do these time trials, but I'm just doing it for the sake of completion. Oh man. Dang it. Oh well. It's fine, it's fine.
That's good enough. So I'm actually, I'm actually going to go for the time trial first. I, I, I think I can do that anyway. Yeah, I can. Cool. Oops. Camera's not the greatest in this, because like, it turns too slow for you to re like. By the time it turns to where you can see the box you need, uh, it's too late, really. Hi, I don't really need to beat you. Yeah, that would be nice if I did. Oh well. Well, oh, it's not the end. Oh, there we go. That's not even good enough? Are you serious? Yeah, this is basically just a race in the minecart with uh, Crunch. It's kind of an interesting level idea, but, you know. Oops. Oh, that was close. Didn't mean to do that. So I guess the goal is just to make the timer stop for as long as possible. boxes to break so hopefully this is enough good also I don't think you can get the gem and the relic at the same time in this game so that's unfortunate <sighs> mm. Alright. Gonna save again.
I might as well just get all the relics, honestly. Wait, is that? Yeah, I got a platinum for both of these. Nice. Yeah, let's just get the relics. And here's another race. It's basically, he brings the power, except not as exciting. Yeah, this one's pretty easy. Gonna get stuck on boxes though. Keep getting platinums, oh my goodness. I'm cool with that. Okay. Yeah, where's the uh, time trial clock? There it is. Okay, I'm just kind of winging it because I don't remember this level too well. Oh jeez, that was close. Go down here, I think. Okay. Slowly coming back to me. Mm, dang it. Oh. I feel nothing in my feet right now. Oh crap. Hmm. This level's a doozy. 
Well then again, it's probably because I'm just not familiar uh, familiar with this one. Dang it. Gotta try and memorize. So we got this, and then we fall. No, you can't get me. I go left, and then yep. Yeah. And then there's a speed at this part. We've stuck with 99 lives for a majority of this playthrough. It's kind of funny, I guess. Oh, come on. <laughs> Yeah, I mainly, uh, I, I, I'm also just getting this done, uh, getting this out of the way so Scrappy doesn't have to deal with it when he comes back. Oh, I think I hear him. Or something, anyway. Okay, seriously, can I stop doing that? So nitros were down here. So gotta be careful. Nope. Okay. I don't remember this part. Hopefully we're not Okay, I hit I hit the exit portal. We're Almost there. Mm. Please be good enough. Okay, cool. I will take that. Ah. That's the only sapphire we've gotten so far. And finally, we've got Force of Nature. I'm back. Are you back? I'm back. Okay. I've, I've just been getting the time trials out of the way while you've been gone. Because, uh... They're the most uninteresting part of this. So you really haven't been missing much. There's a lot, lot more isometric levels in this game than there were in previous games. Yeah. Hopefully this level is... Slight. Hopefully this level won't be too bad just getting a relic. This is... Getting the, bo the box gem here is probably... 
I'd probably say this is like this game's equivalent to a hot, cold, hard crash or a future frenzy. Uh. <laughs> it's not hard for the same reasons, but it's still notorious for just being one of the absolute worst levels in the game, if not the worst. Because you have to be so precise trying to get all the boxes. And it's, there's no checkpoints here. Like, even. Like, dang it. Like, we're doing a time trial right now, but even on the regular level, there's no checkpoints here. And so, like, if you miss any boxes, you have to do the whole thing again. And there are some boxes that. There are some boxes that require, like, really precise stuff, like that one up there. And, uh. It's not fun. Yeah. We, I think we're going to be here for a while. <laughs> Ho yeah. The, hopefully the relic isn't too bad though. Because you're just rushing through the end. I keep thinking that's a... That's a I'm missing like every time crate. Yeah, this is going to be bad. Oh, that again. Oh well. It was gonna be bad anyway. Oh, it would help if I actually hit the time, uh, the stopwatch. Or the. Yeah. The clock, if you will. Hmm. Okay, we've got that now. You're not using Aku Aku as escape, as a snowboard. <laughs> well, that's not until Crash of the Titans, so... That's one thing I'll... Uh, duh. That's one thing I will give uh, Titans over Mighty and Newton. Like, uh, sliding on Aku Aku is, is a pretty cool mechanic. Blizzard is just one of the best levels in that game. Yeah. Oh man. I'm kind of just winging it because I don't remember a lot of the level design here. But so, this level also Gosh. goes on for quite a bit. <laughs> Oops. Okay, I hear it. Go! Alright, now to do these levels properly. Oh boy. <laughs> it begins. Hi. Saving first, just to be safe. We're getting there. All 30 relics. Yep, we just need to uh, the gems now. Okay. So this one's interesting. It's basic. It's basically you're on the minecart the whole time, but you're racing against Crunch. It's kind of weird. <laughs> It's creative, I suppose. <laughs> I think I recall seeing a picture of this in the manual. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of funny seeing Crunch like ride the tiny, uh, the tiny minecart. Wait, 
you trying to go for the box gem or just trying to get first place? Uh, I'm try. Ideally, I'd like to be able to get both in one go. But if we don't get um, first place, uh, you don't have to worry too much because you can literally uh, just do. If you just do nothing the entire time, uh, you'll just win the race. <laughs> it's kind of funny. What now? Like, dang it, I missed the box. Like the the way the so, so for some reason the path you take if you just hold if you just press nothing is the path you can take to just barely win the race. It's it's pretty stupid and funny. Don't know if I'm gonna win this pathway I'm doing, but yeah, we ain't gonna. Well, maybe. No. Because you got the box gem. Okay. Yeah. Well, right, that's fine. That's fine. I just get, I get to show this off at least. I think well, she really should just give you an option to restart if you lose. Yeah. So even uh, uh, I don't know. I don't know. I rem I don't remember. If this is an OG Crash Fray, but I know in Ensign Trilogy, if you lose the motorcycle level, uh, you get to try again. I think it's just Ensign <laughs> Trilogy because I'm definitely remember being booted out. Yeah, I rem yeah I remember being booted out too. So you ready for a uh, a ep another episode of uh, Crash Wins by doing absolutely nothing? I am not touching the controller at all right now. So, so I, I, I swear, like, someone must, someone had to have tested this level and been like, oh, you can just beat it by just not bothering doing anything. We should probably change something. But, no. Nah. Yeah. It's kind of interesting. I'm okay with this. <laughs> Yeah, to be fair, like, after all the stuff we've had to go through, like, it's kind of nice just kind of chilling and letting the game play itself. It gets dangerously close by the end, but it's, it's, it's fine. You know, Crunch had, like, quills going down his back. <laughs> he can't really, uh catch up to us anyway because he's uh oh wait oh okay what the heck was that <laughs> i think i forgot that happens i have no idea but yeah <laughs> well, that was interesting yeah yeah i kind of like the i kind of like the idea of the level Ice Station Bandicoot. This is another race, but it's the propeller suit. And this one's... It, think like ring, Rings of Power, except nowhere near as fast and exciting. It's basically what this level is. Where's that polar bear? Yep. Also, um, one other thing, you can't get the gem, the gems and a relic at the same time. I've tried. Like, even if you get first and get the relic, it just won't give it to you. No.
Oh, okay. I can pop the balloon without getting out in the nitro. I need to catch up, though. So you had to break them in the first place, so... I hope not. That would be kind of evil. Come on, go. Oh, okay, good. No, don't. Mm, dang it. That sucks. I guess they don't want you to cheese it, because if you go on the time trial, the all the nitros disappear. So I guess they just didn't want you to cheat by doing that. Oh boy. So how does it feel to be almost done with this? Like a long, like a nearly lifelong, to a close. <laughs> yeah, basically. That's more or less how I feel. I'm just happy to be almost done with this. Just hopefully for some nature doesn't take too long. Because that's the one thing I've been dreading. Is there a level in, like, OG Crash 1 that you'd consider, like, along the levels of Cold Hard Crash and Future Frenzy? Like, in terms of just, like, being way harder than everything else in the game, and not necessarily in a good way? Sunset Vista. Oh yeah, I completely forgot about that, yeah. Yeah, I... Mm, yeah, yeah, I'd, I'd agree with that. I don't- the thing is with uh, Sunset Vista is that it's not necessarily even, like, what- like, the hardest level in the game. It's the fact that it's super long, and the f and the whole, like, you can't die thing just makes it really obnoxious to play. Especially when you consider there's a Cortex level uh, bonus in there. And you can't retry bonuses. So it's just a- it's just an- a nightmare. Anyways. A pain in the ass in Insane Trilogy 2. Uh, kinda, but I, I don't mind it too much in, in Insane Trilogy because you don't have to worry about the death, uh, the penalty of dying. So it's... Still do, because there's a color gem in there. No, the, the, the color gem, no, the color gem is in... City. Yeah, the Lost City. Yeah, the Lost City has a color gem, which... Uh, it's thankfully a lot shorter, but still. <laughs> 